Finally flying today, starting road work on a project nearly 20 years in the making happens now. The new M231 will eventually be an alternate to US 31 in Ottawa County. It'll include this bridge over the Grand River. But that bridge has been promised for a lot of years now. Ryan Takeo joins us live where some construction starts this morning to explain it all. Ryan? Brent, good morning. Some construction, not the big bridge today, but a smaller bridge over North Cedar Drive. I want to show you a map of the proposed M231. It runs uh, north and south from M104 down to Lake Michigan Drive. You see right here, uh, that's where we are, that circle. It's an alternate to US 31. MDOT thinks with Ottawa County growing as a whole, they say that this is necessary. They need alternates to US 31, and uh, this they say this is the plan to do it. You see how close it is to the Grand River right there. Now, that bridge over the Grand was proposed to be built in 2010, but was waiting on federal funds to make connecting roads a reality. It made news because even if the bridge was built then, cars would not be able to use it right away without those connecting roads. Some dubbed it Michigan's Bridge to Nowhere. But an MDOT spokesperson said building the bridge first is done to make sure the project gets done. They, they often do that with, with the projects. They build the big, bridge, the big bridges first and then they connect the roads. Um, and that is just kind of a safeguard so the project does get completed. Now, from the initial planning stages, this uh, M231 project has been 18 years in the making. Richard said that that is a, due to a combination of red tape and also budget issues. They were supposed to work on the bridge this year, but it's $45 million for that bridge alone, and it wasn't in the budget there. Instead, MDOT's deciding to uh, keep other construction going this year. They plan to work on that bridge next year. In total, M231 is expected to cost about $200 million. Live in Robinson Township, I'm Ryan Takeo, 24-Hour News 8.